Hey guys, it's Daniela from DIY Daniela, and today I am doing a makeup routine. And I actually don't wear all this makeup every day. I'm just going to put on some of the usual, but like it looks like I have a lot of makeup, but really, I don't look that different, so. Yeah, and also there will be a DIY eyeliner because eyeliner can get so expensive, guys. Like, so expensive, and I don't want to buy eyeliner, and this eyeliner is super cheap and easy, and everybody has it, literally. And you don't have to buy anything. Like, it's bringing me to tears. Anyway, guys, um, like this video, and we are so close to a thousand views, like, on my whole channel, which has a lot of videos. Not that many videos, but... And also, I'm trying to get 50 subscribers. Yeah, I don't have many. But, like, I had, I got a lot of mine, like, a long time ago. Like, I had this channel for a year now. And I stopped posting for so long. And I lost, like, 20 subscribers. So now I'm trying to get them back because it's summer. And summer means fun and summer means like I can film videos every day which is what I'm doing I just uploaded a vlog and it already has seven thumbs up yeah not a big deal but I uploaded it probably ten minutes ago so spare me so let's get right into the video so first I'm gonna start off by showing you all the products that I'm going to use and then we're gonna go into the DIY so the CoverGirl Advanced Radiance Olay Age Defying Makeup Sunscreen Broad Spectrum SPF 10. It's a concealer. Um, I have my blush, blush brush. Say that five times. Blush brush. Bl okay, I can't even do that. With well, some, um, you know, blush for my blush brush. Okay, and then I have some powder just to like lighten it up. You know, no contour or anything. And some mascara. Colossal Volume, Mega Plush, and this waterproof one, which I don't really want to wear because I'm going to go swimming later, and it doesn't come off, so, yeah, and then I have one layer of chapstick and one layer of color because, you know, I have no eyeshadow on, okay, um, I'll be right back while I get the eyeshadow, natural, not colors, and some makeup wipes because, you know, I'm no professional. Okay, so now we're going to move on to the DIY, and it's super, super easy, like literally anyone can do it. All you need is a black color pencil, yes, a black color pencil, a cup, and some warm water, and I'm going to say you should let the pencil sit in the water for like 10 minutes, and then try like a swatch in your hand, and then it's like eyeliner, because I'm going to show you what it is before the water. And after the water. Before the water. You know, really, nothing. Okay, the lighting's really bad. But, nothing. Unless you press really hard, and I'm not gonna, you know, press really hard on my eyelid. So, let's, I guess, fill it up, like, halfway. My eyeliner is now in the warm water. I don't know what it's doing. We'll see in 10 minutes. Okay guys, it's been 10 minutes and my eyeliner, color pencil, is out of the warm water and I'm gonna try a swatch on my hand and see how it comes out. Ready? See? It's like eyeliner. I just like, made like one of the best DIYs probably. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, it's a really pretty. So I'm gonna keep it in the warm water because I'm gonna do my makeup now for you guys. So the eyeliner won't like fade or anything. I don't know. And I'm guessing this is good as long as you don't do it every day. Like for Halloween it's especially because you could do like rainbow like all different colors you can you can do more than just black and this is like a really cool diy and it's so inexpensive so i'm gonna start with my makeup the before of my face concealer i 
just, um, it doesn't really match my hand color, but, okay. This feels weird because I'm using the one with, like, um, the cream in it. Like, no, it has, like, soap or something. I don't know. Can you tell the difference? Ooh, well, um, you can tell it's not blended very well. So guys, I did the concealer. Okay, so I'm gonna move on to powder and I'm not gonna put much, so, um. So now I'm gonna move on to eyeshadow, so I'm probably going to lapse this. I'm using this shade. So guys, I am done with the eyeshadow, and now I'm going to be moving on to mascara. In the Colossal Volume Lash Extract. So I am done with the mascara, and now we are moving on to the DIY eyeliner. Let's see how it turns out. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh, this looks really bad. Did I do anything? Hmm. It's not letting me. Why? You have to fail. Oh. There's, um, a shadow on it. Explains. Oh gosh. Oh. I don't understand how people do it. This is impossible. I think it's because I have on eyeshadow and so what I realized is that when I put the eyeliner back in, the water got cold, so it went back to being a colored pencil. So I had to do the whole heating process again, and hopefully that won't happen to you. So do it 10 minutes before you put your eyeliner on, and that's how it came out. It's brown. This is the first time I've done eyeliner, so no hate. And then I just, like put more a little bit more concealer on I put on lip balm and lip gloss I put on a little bit of blush you can see some of the powder I forgot to mention this but I did use a brow filler so that's why they look darker and thank you so much for watching the DIY was kind of a fail but it worked all you have to do is keep it warm the whole time when you were using it and please subscribe and like and I'll see you guys next time.